is a beautiful day in the neighborhood. With snow. With snow. So, in true Tiff and Carrie fashion, or Tiff fashion, I forgot to take the link down for the Love is Louder shirt. So, mm -hmm. looks like I won't be placing that order until Monday. That's okay. So, for those of you who procrastinated, you do have time. And don't forget right now while you're watching the video, if you think you're going to like it, which come on, how can you not like it? Just go up right now or down wherever you are and just hit that thumbs up button. Yeah. Just hit it. Just hit it. Hit it. Don't you just want to hit it? <laughs> hit it. No? Okay. I'm going so ahead I want to show you Carrie's lovely breakfast and keep in mind that I ate cereal because she was not awake when I got up. Look at this. She's made herself a really nice breakfast. I have. She has a pancake or two, it looks like. Mm -hmm. Some eggs, bacon, and a glass of juice. Sorry about this on the table. Meanwhile, I'm over here starting out these things. Starting and finishing them. Starting and finishing them, yes. Uh, our photo uh, postcards to send out to people. Yep, we're sending them out to uh, patrons and to people who have shared the video very lovingly. Oh, oh, put my hand on the speaker there for a second, I think. People who have shared the video, mm -hmm. uh, it's been really great lately. Yes. We've been seeing a really big rise in shares and thumbs up, and that's pretty awesome. Mm -hmm. I, I know I say awesome a lot, and you guys always get on me for it, in a loving way, I'm sure, but I will never stop being thankful. We have been thankful from day one, we have. and we will continue to be thankful. In fact, if we ever stop being thankful, I will probably stop making videos. Yeah. Yes, because that would just be horrible. You people, it, a thank you is free. It's free. It doesn't take much to just say thanks. Mm -hmm. So anyway. It makes people feel good. Yeah, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go ahead and get finished up. We're going to fill these out. We're going to personalize them, send some cards out to people. Alexa, stop. Oh, that's my timer. Alexa, stop. Alexa, it's not just for the weather. She also makes a darn good timer, folks. Mm -hmm. But anyway, will she fall? Mm -hmm. I'm going to finish uh, some stuff up, and then we are going to do some fun stuff around here today. Yeah. Yeah? We got anything planned? No. Yeah, we do. That's why it's so fun. You just don't even know it yet. You have no idea what's going to happen to you soon. After breakfast, lunch, it's going to be nap time. Uh, no. No. Mm-hmm. Stop letting that little fetus run your life. We have a million years well, ahead of time gonna, for that. It's going to run our lives for the next 18 years. <laughs> That's true. So. Just 18? Probably 30. We are in a new generation where we will probably have our child living with us for a very long time. Probably. Go to college, come back home, mm -hmm. you know, go off to med school, some type of, of school. Yeah. All the things you want for your kids. We could end up having a musician who doesn't want to go to school. Or maybe someone who invents something. You never know. Um, you never know. Never know. All right, guys. Well, we will catch you in a bit. Yeah. Hi, baby Rue. So this is it. What is it? This is what's left. Ow! <clears throat> what happened? Well, look at the tape dispenser. Yeah. Do you see how it's missing? Like parts of the suspenser. Yeah. I don't even know how we can use this. I'm gonna have to pull it off with my teeth. We'll just pull. Oh, off the... look, there's some here. We'll pull the tape off and put it on a different dispenser. Fine. But this is what happened. Okay. So last night, I was in the bathroom and then I thought to myself, man, I think you can go, like, your arm's gonna hurt. It's fine. So, like, last night, I said to myself, crap, I bet you I forgot to throw away my chocolate shake. I can't let the cats eat the chocolate shake uh -huh. because they could get sick. I had to go and take care of it. So, what do I do? I go take care of it. Well, guess what my a-hole cats did? They took the tape that wasn't broken, a perfectly good, almost brand new tape dispenser, and knocked it on the floor uh -huh. while I was out there taking care of the shake. They so didn't I even eat, really. No, we had like two sips. I know. So I came out here and I was like, you know what? I'm just going to take my socks off. And I do this neat little thing where I just go like this, <laughs> go on the floor here. I just press my foot down and zip my sock out. Okay. Well, this one, I stepped on the tape dispenser <laughs> and popped it through, cut my foot all up, and now 
there's plastic <laughs> inside my foot. There's okay. not. It feels like it is. I walk on it and it's a hump. Ugh. Ow! We'll take a look at it. What do you mean take a look at it? I need to... It's, <coughs> I will take a look at it. <laughs> I can't walk on it. It's very sore. I imagine. This thing popped. It sounded like a firecracker. Yeah? Like an M80 went off. It just went... It shattered. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it shattered into my foot everywhere. I will take a look again. You're not a doctor. You're yeah. not an MD. But I can see if there's so plastic you gonna, in your foot. Yeah, you're going to do surgery. You're going to cut my foot where the slit is and get the plastic out. No. I told you there's plastic in it last night and you just laughed at me. <laughs> you laughed at me and then all of our friends online laughed at me. You did. They did. Yes. You guys all... It was so funny. It's not first funny. They said, first they said, this needs to be a TV show. Stepping on things. Oh, great. <laughs> stepping on things. And then 10 minutes later when you started to talk about it all over again. Because it still hurt. Our friends were like, oh, I've heard this episode before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thanks, Victor and Shelby. <laughs> it was... Hilarious. It was you, wasn't it? Oh. Wasn't it? Was it you? Oh, great. Then it was Prim. But why not Katniss? Katniss wouldn't do that to me. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> she wouldn't do that to me. Okay. You would, though, wouldn't you, little Rue? No, she wouldn't. wouldn't she you? loves you. Tell me. She's like, eh, I don't want you wrapping any presents that aren't for anyone but me. Why would she say that? I don't know. That's how she talks in my head. <laughs> oh. She does talk to you in your sleep. Okay. You talk back to her. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No. Yes, you I'm do. awake. I know all that's going on. No, you don't. <laughs> I hate that I, I've done that my entire life. I hate it. Yeah. Don't. I want you to tell me. I want you to pinky swear to me right now on camera that you won't film me ever again while I'm talking. No. You know, somebody commented, she's awake. That's fake. Oh. Well, no. They said your reaction with the black mask was fake too, but. Oh, that's right. They did. <laughs> It was 100% real. Oh. Honey, what are you doing? <laughs> you sounded like a robot when you said that. <laughs> Honey, what are you doing? I kind of feel like a robot right now. Going through the motions. You know, I'm actually kind of worried about something. What are you worried about? You really sound like you're reading that. <laughs> Sorry. What are you worried about? What are you worried about? So, am I addicted to my game? I think so. I didn't notice that until today. How did you notice it? Well, because I set a timer like several times so I would be able to check something. Okay. So here's the thing. Yeah. Just, I play this Family Guy game on the iPad. I've been playing it for like two years now. Family yeah. Family Guy Quest for stuff. Mm -hmm. And things have been so hectic at school, I haven't had a chance to play it. Mm -hmm. So I noticed that since school got out this weekend and I've been, you know, at home, it's been really nice to be able to play. Right. And I haven't missed anything. Like, I've been able to collect all my stuff. Right. So is it an addiction or... Is it just because I'm done with school? Like, are you making up for play? lost time? Yeah. I, I mean, don't know. I know what a definition of addiction is. Yeah. I'm not hurting anyone. I'm not, you know, letting it interfere with my life. And I definitely don't. But, like, today, I don't know. Like, I feel <coughs> like today, while you were laying down, I took advantage of the fact that I could just continue to keep playing this game and not have to answer to anyone. Yeah. I mean, I got so hot and I'm stuffy because you were laying on me with a blanket, two pillows. I mean, I'm like burning up. I can hear that yeah. you're stuffy, yeah. So like I feel, I don't know, like do you, have you noticed any of this before today? Well, I know that you play your games a lot and sometimes... Like when I want to talk to you, you're playing your games. Or when, when I, I want stop, you to do you stuff, you're playing me. games. But you always have to finish your game okay. before you answer. And sometimes you accidentally start another one. Yeah, I've done that before. Sometimes it annoys me. 
So that's something I'm going to have to work on mm -hmm. because I don't want to put my games, obviously, before you or anyone. Right. Um, I mean, I guess I just never really noticed it because I'm not late with homework. I meet every deadline. I'm early with stuff. Right. You know, we're... I'm not spending money on games or anything like that. Right. Okay. I don't know why I just started thinking about that before you sat down. I picked up my game because Alexa went off, like letting me know that I had a timer set. Right. You know, so I was like, okay, check the timer. And then when your mom was here, it it went off then too. So I have like timer set, so I remember to to play to not to well to go and check your game collect to leave one game that you're already playing and go to the other game addiction yeah oh i don't want to have an addiction to gaming <sighs> you know i think maybe it was like making up or it's like making up for the fact that mm -hmm. i don't really get on the xbox because i think the xbox is like so much more time consuming than playing my ipad game or whatever i think think that you think that, but I think that you actually spend more time playing your iPad games than you do than you if you were to get on Xbox. So I need an intervention. Okay. Is that what you're saying? Maybe. Okay. I'm going to do like a no electronic day tomorrow. Good luck. I can do that. Well, I was really hoping you'd play some Xbox with me. <laughs> <laughs> if my headache is gone. Yeah, your headache's been pretty rough, like, all day today. It has. I feel awful. You want to tell everybody what's been going on? Sure. Okay. All right, so how have you been feeling? Well, you know, I slept in today, which was nice. And I didn't get sick, I think, because I slept in. So that was awesome. Yeah. But I started to develop a little headache throughout the day. And it's getting a little bit worse. I don't know if it's because of the TV and all the lights or what it is um i haven't eaten a lot today either i haven't felt like eating anything i just don't feel good but i don't have a fever i just checked my temperature so okay that's good i'm trying to get rid of my headache with this headache ease balm it's a peppermint yeah i like balm. that stuff you want to show it a little bit more yeah there it is yeah it's like a, a peppermint balm and it's supposed to naturally help the headache go away. So you put it on every 5 to 15 minutes and then as needed after that. That's what it says. Well, just by filming you <laughs> and watching over your shoulder on the wall there, yeah. the light in here has changed from like light to dark to blue to red to light to white. Mm -hmm. I wonder if that's like... I don't know. Having anything to do with it. I don't know. I don't think the TV's helping. Okay. Well, why so don't we I, turn the TV off? When we go in the bedroom, I'm just going to put my mask on and go to sleep. Okay. So. Well, that sounds like a good idea. But, no shrekking today. I know. That's a, a bonus. Little, yeah. That is a big bonus. Just a headache. So, so something else we've noticed today, too, yeah. is that Rubear. Every time one of us gets up from wherever we're sitting, yeah. doesn't matter where we are, she jumps to that spot. Yeah, like she likes the warmth. Well, and she also does it in the bedroom, too. Oh, yeah. As soon as I get out of bed in the morning, what is happening here? sprints to oh. where I was laying. Yeah, she does do that. She really does. What are you doing, Miss Katniss? Katniss. Oh, she, she's not going to like that. Whenever I put on my Burt's Bees... She makes it like it's gasoline or something like that. Oh. Is she Fleming? Uh, 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 <laughs> not too bad. I'm surprised. I don't know if you knew this, but this morning when you made that bacon, uh -huh. I grabbed a little piece and I took a bite and Rue smelled it and she kept like smelling my breath when I bit the bacon. Uh -huh. And then all of a sudden she went... <sighs> Like, her mouth was, like, way open. And she oh. wouldn't even taste it, so I don't even know what it was. She does that every time she smells something. It's just why. really weird that she does that. Come here, Katniss. Love me. Oh, yeah, this Love is going to work me. out really well. 
You've interrupted what she was doing, so she's never going to stay. Yeah. Yep. See you later, cat. <laughs> she's going back in the if it fits, I sits box. We need to get rid of that because it's got tape on it and the cat's uh, going to eat it. I know. I know. <laughs> what are you doing? You know what I'm doing. You know what you just did. What did I do? You scratched my back and it felt so good. Yeah. You guys ever have that? Like a complete like back scratch that just feels like, okay. I mean literally and utterly amazing. Oh god, it was so good at like, it took me to another world. Did that? Yes. That's good. It did. You mean to return the favor? No How's thanks. How's that? Mm, no thanks. Fine. My back's not itchy. It's my shins that are itchy. Your shins? Yeah. My shins get itchy every winter. Oh. I put two layers of lotion on it today. This lighting is really dark in here. Here. Let me see if I can fix it. Okay. Apparently she knows how to fix things. Oh! And she does! <laughs> Good job, Did it babe. work? It did work. Oh, kind of. Look at that. All right, let's see if this will work. How about that? Boy, that's dangerous, huh? It is, but... It's fine. Why don't it's we working. Move this way? Yeah, In front let's of get, the camera. get into the shot. There we go. So, ultrasound, we've talked about. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. That'll be Monday. Yes, it will. I'm really excited. So what are we going for? I mean, I know that we're, is it just another checkup so they can release us to an actual OB? Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's all we're going for. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is there anything yep. else that we should expect? Like, we'll get to hear the heartbeat because you got to hear it last time. Yeah, I imagine that he will check the heartbeat again. And is there any chance we'll know the gender? No. Are you sure? I'm positive. You cannot tell that early. Okay. You know, I read online some people knew at eight weeks. How is that possible? There's early tests that you can do. Like, if we were going to do the um, chromosome testing, uh -huh. we'd probably be able to find out. Oh, okay. But you can't do the chromosome testing until 10 weeks. So, I don't know about how people found out at eight weeks. Oh. But. Yeah, no, I saw that online. Yeah. So, I never knew until we got pregnant that mm -hmm. you had to wait so long to find out the gender. For. for if you do it through an ultrasound. Yeah, I had no idea. Like, I was that, uh, I guess, baby illiterate, Yeah, you would say. That's okay. Yeah, I had no idea. So. But we had fun today, you guys. It was fun waking up and doing the Saturday meme day. Yeah. I really liked that. So that was kind of more of like a trial and error to see, like, how it would work out. Uh -huh. So I think it's going to definitely be better if I can show you uh, the pictures um, at the same time, so maybe one of us will be able to hold the picture up the whole time. Yeah. So we'll work on it. It's definitely going to be a two-person thing, but mm -hmm. we did get a ton of submissions for the Elf on the Shelf stuff. Did we? Yeah, it was pretty awesome. There's awesome. so many in the email. Yeah. Or in the messages. I loved it. And we did get a ton of addresses written out for everyone, and yes. I still have some to ask for from yesterday, so those of you who are waiting all day checking your inbox i actually haven't sent any for today so i'll be doing that tomorrow sorry things happen i just couldn't get around to it yeah but you look exhausted so i'm not gonna keep talking anymore oh i don't, I don't know why i don't know why either but i guess it's the baby <laughs> yeah boy and the baby I guess. okay <laughs> all right guys well i guess that's it i'm gonna go take care of sleepy mcgee here yeah all right thanks okay well thanks for hanging out with us today and, and sharing us with your friends Gosh, all right. I love you. I love you too. All right, we love you too, guys, and we'll catch you on the flippity.